Hey everyone, welcome to another one in Phasmophobia. I finally got the lanterns. Yes, I would love to go on an art map now, but it's 2 a.m. on a sun Monday morning right now here. Yeah. I've just recorded the challenge mode and it takes forever to upload, so I thought, hey, I'm gonna play one short round in the meanwhile. Oh, ghost photo. No! But look at those. Dip, dip, dip. Ah, oh, they're so cool. I love the lanterns. And now my PC is gonna die. Great. Great job. So I'm gonna set up everything. I'll be right back. And I already forgot where the breakup was. But it's fine. Okay, we get a hiding spot here. Hiding spot here. Oh my god. Whoa. What was that? That was a weird sound. Hey, Boney. <laughs> I knew something was off. Aha, uh -huh. hello, ghosty. Are you down there, up here? Where are you? Okay, we have found the ghost. We have found the bone. So let's quickly go check. We got some hiding spots right here, which is fine. I'm too late for that. Let's take care of you. Mm, you're not here. Mm, okay. I might be a little jumpy because it's late. It's 2 a.m. now. Okay, it's going down, but unfortunately, they like to roam between those two rooms. Okay. You don't want to do anything about this? No? Interesting. What did you interact with? Not my lantern. Okay, um, let's... Where's the crucifix? Give me the crucifix. That's important. That has to go in as soon as possible. Yes, AP. So... I was about to say, was that an orb floating right before my eyes? Oh my god, you are a mimic. Oh, be careful, you could mimic a demon. Okay, we know what ghost it is. We just need uh, some pictures and that's it. We get a mimic! You know what, guys? This is now a ghost guide. This is the guide about the mimic. I'm gonna show it to you because... We are now currently playing on zero evidence and um, where's the mimic? These are the evidence. So what's important about the mimic is if you are playing with evidence, if you for example get spirit box and UV and orbs, you'll have this and you're gonna say hey there's no ghost here, but it's because you will also get freezing because it's a mimic. Because the orbs don't count as evidence they are more like an ability if you have this combo you might think it's an on unreal if you have this combo check for uv make sure to check for uv if you play on three evidence what was the other combo this was the hunter combo right yeah if you have this combo make sure you check for a spirit box because the mimic will give you those four evidence but the orb doesn't count as evidence okay if you play on zero evidence, you will have an orb. If you see an orb on zero evidence, you are 100% dealing with a mimic. If you have EMF 5 or dots or ghost riding, you can rule out mimic immediately because the mimic doesn't have one of those. Okay? <laughs> so this was the part about the ghost guide. Um, you have to be careful. A mimic could mimic anything. Let's see if we can figure out what ghost it is mimicking, shall we? we? We actually can. It could mimic a wraith at some point. It could mimic a banshee. You can actually get a banshee scream from a mimic, yeah. You can also be hunted early by a mimic, if it's mimicking a demon. Yes, it's possible. So let's set up some sensors. So this was the ghost room, right? The orb was in here? Was it in there? Where is it? Oh, the ghost just stepped in there. I think 
it is currently where's my photo camera it may be currently mimicking a wave actually Now it's not mimicking a wave, we know that. Okay, so it could mimic a UA for example, it could mimic a Banshee. Let's see if we can figure that out. So for that, uh, I'm gonna set up some stuff right here, real quick. Oh no, I didn't wanna do that. The smudgies are supposed to go in there. This is supposed to stay here. And this and these go here. This is just hiding spot setup. I can also set up for poltergeist because it could mimic a poltergeist. It could also mimic an onweo at one point. Yeah. Okay. Um. Bup, 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 the camera in case it mimics an, uh, a phantom. Okay. Uh, we get. Do we have two in there? Oh, I got the other one here. Okay, Mr. Mimic, do you want to show us something? Okay, you threw something around here. This one I've taken already. Let's see if we can get like, for example, a Banshee Scream or like a Poltergeist Mimic or something like that. That would be so cool. Or even the Ohan Mimic, we need to have uh, smudge sticks near us. So we won't get cornered here if it's a day open. So this is now for poltergeist. So if you have, for example, all of the sudden a poltergeist multi throw and then in the next second it walks through a sensor towards you and uh, doesn't uh, step into the salt because it's mimicking a wave then you can be sure that you're dealing with a mimic. Okay, let's see what it mimics. Let's see if it mimics a bench here at any point or a wave. We got an EMF here, right? Yeah. Now I'm curious, what will you mimic? Mr. Mimic or are you Miss Mimic? You are a Mr. Mimic. Hmm, it threw something again. Let me quickly get those photos. Hey, ghosty. Leave that here so I can find it in case I need it. Is that now it's off? So it can, for example, mimic like. Uh, let's turn off the light. So you heard that? That that was a poltergeist ability. You heard that? Give me the EMF. Give it to me. You heard that? Where? Where is it? Where? Where did you do it? No. I thought that was... Wait... Huh? Are you kidding me? This one? But... What? It sounded like it! Wait... Are you... Are you just mimicking like twins now? What are you mimicking? You see? That's insane. Yeah, that's the lantern. Interesting, interesting. Oh, it was off, okay. I'm curious, what will it mimic next? Oh, we need a photo of it, oh damn it, why? So it's both. We can test if it mimics a Moroi now. Actually, we can test that because if it has mimicked a Moroi, I should curse now. Let's quickly check my sanity. I know this is gonna be like a ghost guide and a normal one. 90%, okay. 90%, let's uh, go into the house, stay in the lights, and. Let's see if our sanity drains. Did you turn on a light or was that me? This is for Unreal. Let's 
flying a lot, but it hasn't mimicked a stalking ghost yet, did you? I can't take this with me! I hope it worked. Yes, it worked. Oh, I didn't even have to take those. Okay, nice. Uh, let's leave that near the doors in case it mimics um, a UA. Could be possible. I know the sensors are everywhere. Like, do 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 do. do. Um, did I put the? I think the sound sensor is there. Let's not stay in the dark for so long. Let's see if it has mimicked a Moai. That would be cool, actually. I'm curious what it will mimic next. So a mimic can be anything. No, not a Moai. It hasn't mimicked a Moai, unfortunately. So uh, I'm gonna watch that ghost for a bit more. I have to drain my sanity. It's gonna take forever. I have to get rid of the lantern here. Because they also prevent my sanity from draining. <laughs> okay. Oh, you stepped into the salt. Interesting. And you blew out my lantern. Come on, please do a banshee or a wraith. Something obvious, please. Please. So yeah, this is gonna be half a mimic guide, half a normal one. But unfortunately that ghost is not mimicking anything suspicious yet. There you go, that and that's why I hear the salt being stepped on because it's trying to walk towards me because it's mimicking a banshee right now. Watch that here. It mimicked a banshee. See it try to walk towards me. See that? Come on, mimic a yoy now. Come on. Uh, the mimic changes ghost type every minute. Huh? No? Ah, uh, is it already over? I think it stopped mimicking a banshee. It's now something else. Yeah, it stopped mimicking a banshee, I think. <laughs> there goes a normal whisper again. Oh my god, that's so cool. I should be near the EMF though. Because I could mimic a wave. Oh, that was so funny. We, we were playing together and... I've heard a banshee scream on the power mic and I was like, what? Usually a banshee walks towards you all the time. Why do I get a banshee scream now? The ghost hasn't walked towards us before. And then, like a few minutes later, all of a sudden the EMF goes off in our room. And we were like, why is the EMF going off? And then we just saw the ghost walking away from us through the sensors without stepping into the sword. And I told them, guys, are you sure there was no orb in that room? And they were like, oh, yes, we, we've looked for orbs. And I was like, but what just happened is impossible, except it's a mimic. I went into the room, grabbed my camera, looked around, orb. <laughs> it was a zero evidence one, by the way. So if you play on zero evidence, Mimic should be the easiest ghost to figure out, but no matter with how many evidence you play, it could happen that the Mimic mimics a demon and hunts you the moment you step into the house. And if that happens, yeah, of course, many people are afraid then and are like, damn it, it's a demon, I'm gonna leave, I ain't going back in there. I can totally understand that, but at least you should try and check for orbs or just go into the house with the crucifix and smudge sticks and sit go in, go to a hiding spot immediately go to any hiding spot and wait there and if the ghost all of a sudden doesn't hunt anymore then uh that doesn't mean the ghost is here don't worry that was an air ball. it's not mimicking an oni right now <laughs> So yeah, mm, that was a normal door touch. Just would you please stop that? 
It's not mimicking any early hunting ghosts, I think. I'm sitting here in the dark room for a long time now. Oh. Are you maybe at one point gonna mimic an Onoyo? Or maybe a Yoe? I mean a Yoe would be nice too. I had so many mimics mimicking Yoe slamming your doors. I think if it's a mimic, they are more likely to use the ghost's ability that they are mimicking. It feels like it, because they have only one minute time to do the ghost's stuff, you know? <laughs> I still way too high. Capture a photo of the ghost. Damn it. Can you please mimic an Oni or a young Thay? By the way, if it decides to mimic a Thay, I think the age is gonna be set to a random value. So you can't exactly... Whoa! Bobby, <laughs> Damn it, I wanted my camera! Yeah. <laughs> yes, in case that happens, you can take a photo of the door the ghost closes. Because you get an EMF reading on that. See? It's mimicking an early hunting ghost! Yay! It's mimicking something early hunting, right? No, we were at 62. And maybe we are exactly at 50. Uh oh. It's still. Is it still here? Or did it dodge that salt somehow? I mean, I got a crucifix here. I'm gonna die. I have to take a photo of the ghost. I'm just gonna die. The ghost is gonna eat my cheeks. All of them. Are you mimicking an unreal? Beep, 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 beep. No, I'm backing off. I'm backing off. Mm, it destroyed my salt here. Damn. I should be able to take a photo. I should be. I stand here. The crucifix. I'm still in range, right? Come on, ghost. Try to hunt again. <gasps> There's a crucifix in the room still. I forgot. Even there, baby. Damn. <laughs> I wanted to save that crucifix. Bad ghosty. Bad ghosty. Eating up all my freakies. Mm, that was normal, I think. <laughs> that was the knife. <laughs> Come on, start hunting. You can start hunting from there. <laughs> Thank you. Don't break the lights. <sighs> I should have my photo, right? Thank you. What are you doing to my ghost highway? Hey, that's for you for later, not for now. Back to your room, now. Go back to your room this instant. It's still here. Would you please stop blowing out my candles and messing around with my stuff here? Did you get back to your room that quickly? You burned the crucifix and threw something? Are you? Maybe it's mimicking uh, twins? Or it's somehow able to dodge those. Maybe it's walking past them, around them, I don't know. This area here is weird during the hunt as well. I we should move this a little bit further over here. You saw that, that crucifix saved us several times. Okay, ghosty, please start hunting from your room. I still have... Let's see what it's gonna be. Like. Why were you so slow? It was so slow for a brief second. Maybe it's actually mimicking... Twins? It's in the basement. But yeah, that's the mimic. Um, I'm gonna head out. I got my perfect game, so... Whew, I caught it at 3.30 a.m. in the morning. Wow. <laughs> but hey, it was fun. Oh, maybe... <laughs> maybe it was near the end mimicking a shade. That could also be possible. 
Also, they could mimic a spirit if you smudge it, then um, it actually can't hunt for three minutes, even if it changes the ghost type within those three minutes. It's it's so weird. The mimic is a fun ghost. But it's also dangerous because you never know. You have to expect everything when you know you're dealing with a mimic. If you don't know you're dealing with a mimic, you're screwed anyways, because it can all of a sudden mimic and they open. Welcome back. I've prepared some jobs for you. Because, uh, for example, you have two hands with, like, nothing special, normal speed. It mimics a spirit or a djinn or a mare or something like that. And then, all of a sudden, the ghost comes to you and knows where you are. Oh, especially on Apocalypse. This is so terrifying. Believe me, you're sitting there at the entrance in sunny meadows and... Ugh, this is just terrifying. You hear all of the sudden the ghost was every hunt, the first two or three hunts, you heard it from a distance through the paramic maybe, or maybe you heard it ah it's somewhere behind the chapel. It got close to the entrance several times, but it didn't come to me. And all of a sudden you hear a ghost that is even faster than 150% its crazy speed and coming right towards you. Oh, this is so terrifying. And then you realize, wait a second, it knows where I am, it's... Is it a Diochen? That can't be. It has to be a Mimic. That's how you can figure out a Mimic. If it mimics all of a sudden a Diochen, you know it, but most of the time you're dead. Because you don't expect it. That's the danger of a Mimic. We last time had a Mimic, it was mimicking a demon. And uh, it was throwing events around it. And I don't know how it did it. It was a demon in one second and in the other second it started a hunt, but it was a day open. That was so dangerous and terrifying, believe me, if you don't expect that. So now look at the time. We have been in there for 19 minutes in total, around 19 minutes, and the ghost has changed ghost type 18 times. So it changes ghost type every minute, actually. And yeah, it was more out of its favorite room than inside its favorite room interesting but yeah so i hope this helps you to understand your next and make a little bit better if you play on zero evidence make sure to check for orbs as soon as possible the moment you find the ghost room check for orbs because if you play on zero evidence and you get an evidence it's not possible except it's a mimic so yeah Actually, the easiest goes for zero evidence runs, and hey, nice run actually. Wow, I didn't expect it to be that good. I thought, oh, I better play Tangle World, it's late. Okay, so yeah, that's it for the Mimic. I hope this is gonna help you, so see you in the next one. Bye!